Hello. I am Zara. And today we are going to learn about climate zones. What is a climate zone? A climate zone is an area that has its own climate depending on which they have their own type of food, clothing, shelter, crops, vegetation and wildlife. The earth is divided into imaginary lines on its surface that helps us to distinguish the climate zones. These lines are called the lines of latitude that run in east-west direction and measure the north-south of the earth's surface. Equator is the most important line of latitude because it is from here where we can measure other lines of latitude. Equator measures zero degree. Next are the two lines of tropics that takes over the north and south of the equator. These lines are called the Tropic of Cancer and Tropic of Capricorn respectively. Tropic of Cancer measures 23 and a half degrees north whereas Tropic of Capricorn measures 22 and a half degrees south. Then come the lines of circles that covers the polar regions in the north and south and are called the Arctic Circle and the Antarctic Circle respectively. The Arctic Circle in the North Pole measures 66 and a half degree north while the Antarctic Circle in the South Pole measures 66 and a half degree south. The area between the Tropic of Cancer and Tropic of Capricorn is called the Torrid Zone also known as the Tropic Zone. Features of Torrid Zone It's warm throughout the year. This zone observes only two seasons annually that is, the hot season and wet season. The average temperatures can range between 20 and 35 degrees Celsius. Most deserts and rainforests are found in these zones. Countries in Torrid Zone There are many countries such as Indonesia, Malaysia, Thailand, Vietnam, Taiwan, Burma, Sri Lanka, India, Bangladesh, Ghana, Madagascar, Chile, Brazil, Argentina, and Mexico are some of them. Astronomical facts about Torrid Zone The sun's heat falls directly on this zone. This is the reason why this zone experiences two major events known as solstice and equinoxes. When the sun is at its greatest distance from the equator, then this event is called as the solstice. When the sun is towards the farthest north then it is known as summer solstice. It usually takes place around 22nd of July. When the sun is towards the farthest south then it is known as winter solstice. It usually takes place around 22nd of December. When the sun is at its closest distance to the equator, then this event is called as the equinox. During an equinox, the earth experiences 12 hours of day and 12 hours of night. When the sun is closest towards the north of the equator then it is known as the autumn equinox. It usually takes place during 22nd or 23rd of September. When the sun is closest towards the south of the equator then it is known as the spring equinox. It usually takes place during 22nd of March. The area between the lines of tropics and the lines of circle is called the temperate zone. Features of temperate zone It has mild temperatures. It enjoys all four seasons annually, like summer winter, autumn and spring. It is a perfect vacation zone. The average temperatures can range between 0 to 20 degrees Celsius. Countries in temperate zone The majority of the world's population lives in the temperate zone. The United States, Canada, Uruguay, all of Europe, Northern Africa, the Middle East, Japan and New Zealand are the parts of temperate zone. The area between the two lines of circles and its respective two poles makes the frigid zone. Features of frigid zone It is extremely cold and freezing. This zone experiences snow all year. It has weird day and night cycles. It has six months of day and six months of night as the sun, sometimes does not rise or set for 24 hours. The average temperature in these zone ranges between 0 to minus 47 degrees Celsius. Countries in Frigid Zone The North Frigid Zone comprises of eight modern territories, namely Alaska, USA, Finland, Greenland, Iceland, Sweden, Norway, Russia, Canada, while only the continent of Antarctica lies in the South Frigid Zone.